Absolutely. I'm gonna be that guy today. <laughs> What's up, dude? Josh, right? Yeah. Yeah, Jesse. What's up? Jesse. Nice to meet you. What's up, man? Jesse. Hey, man. What's up? Nice to meet you, man. Yeah, yeah. Now? Nick, Nick, nice to meet you. This turned out cool, man. Yeah, yeah. I, I, luckily, I had a run this for work up here. I had to deliver it at eight o'clock. I'm like, I'm getting paid to go to <laughs> Jack. Nice. To yourself? And stuff? Yeah. No big deal. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no big deal. I'm gonna be getting a couple of canoes today, man. We need back. All I need is mullet. <laughs> All I need is just put my finger in the water. Jesse. Oh, oh yeah. That's how we do it here, huh? Yeah. I'm Wendy. Uh, Nick. Nick nice, to too. nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right, All right dudes. who else do we wait? Oh, here. What's up, dudes? Before we get further in this video, just wanted to give you some information about what went down this day. Uh, so something unique to our channel is we have a pretty big Facebook group. It's a community page uh, for our YouTube channel where our subs can go in there, talk to each other. Uh, they post up uh, local fishing reports, their catches, just talk fishing, funny memes, whatever, all kind of cool stuff. But I thought it would be a pretty cool idea to host a fishing tournament out of the Facebook group so all of our subs could come out and have a good time. Before I posted the video, I wanted to make sure that everything that we were doing was completely legal. So I called FWC to get the rules on hosting a fishing tournament and it turns out there aren't hardly any unless you're doing bass tournaments. So anyway, we hosted this turnout, uh, tournament and had a really good turnout, super fun. And we plan on doing this a whole lot more in the future. So uh, join the Facebook group. If you hadn't heard of Slot City Fishing, we're three brothers, two of us are active duty military. So we've got a lot of travel videos. Uh, we started the channel down in Corpus Christi, Texas, and then done a lot of fishing in Louisiana, Alabama. Uh, we lived in the panhandle of Florida, and now we're on the East Coast in Jacksonville. So lots of videos from all around the country. Uh, and then we do a lot of product reviews, how-tos, and tips. Uh, and we do a lot of giveaways. So uh, subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Hit the notification bell. That way you'll get notified whenever we do an upload. That way you'll know the most current information, what's going on as far as our giveaways and stuff like that. So uh, anyway, we'll let this video play out. And then at the end of the video, I'll give you some more information. This was like a trial run for the tournament stuff. We're gonna be hosting some bigger ones. And the YouTube channel has a lot of sponsors that are on board to give out prizes and stuff like that. So. Uh, we'll give you more information about events that are coming up at the end of this video. So, uh, yeah, this is a really good day. Uh, check it out. It was a lot of fun. All right, dudes. Got a special morning for you. We got a bunch of members from the Slot City Fishing Group out here. We may or may not be doing a little tournament today. I don't know what the legal rules are, if I can be like, even allowed to do that. But uh, we're launching out here. And uh, the, the rules are uh, best inshore slam, trout, redfish, flounder. So like if, you, if nobody ends up catching a flounder, if you get the biggest trout and redfish, you can still win. Or if you know only a trout, whatever, you can still win. Uh, but the fish have to be legal and you gotta take a picture of it or have it on the stringer. So on a bump board or a tape, measure, like I'm not, I don't care about what kind of measuring device it is, but uh, yeah, super good turnout, man. Thank you guys for, for showing out. <laughs> all right dudes we made it we out here yes, sir. slot city fishing pseudo tournament it's not that serious man we're really just out here uh trying to have some fun but we're playing by tournament rules but uh my strategy is gonna catch a big trout first because i i know that's what's hitting right now then I'm gonna go for a red, then I'm gonna go for a flounder. Cause I think the flounder are gonna be harder to come by today than any other fish. That's usually how it is really. Yeah. Also, uh, my drive is squeaky as hell for some reason. <laughs> squeaky drive McGee over here. Just for y'all's awareness in the footage. <laughs> but uh, yeah, there's some heavy hitters out here with us, man. Dustin and uh, Wendy. Uh, should be a good day, man. It's awesome that everybody was willing to come out here and do this. Yo, I'm on. Yeah. 
flounder. It's just flounder. I think it's too small though. Yeah, it's like 12 and a half. <clears throat> Hell yeah. Caught me a flounder, boys. Uh, 12 and a half inches. Put them in the fish bag, save them for later. Hopefully I can get me a trout in the red. Win, win us this uh, slot city fishing, win this tournament, you know? Jesse, you're not gonna believe it. Jess, my drive broke. I swear. Same way the uh, threads pulled out. Well guys, my drive broke. Same exact way uh, Jesse's did. Yeah, the, the threads in there pulled right out. But I'm just gonna keep fishing this tournament and not let it get to me right now. Yes. Thirteen and a half, little guy. Definitely not gonna win the tournament with that. Electric chicken, paddle tail. Whoa. Well, you maxed out the red. Uh, yeah, I think so. I don't know. Another flounder. Yeah. He's bigger than my last one. This guy's 15 and a... 15. All right, dudes, I was hoping I would get a different species. This is my uh, second flounder. Uh, he's bigger than the last one. He's about 14 and a half, not quite 15. Um, but two flounder one day. Can't complain too much about that. I don't know. Did you hear me say my drive broke? Oh. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I thought you were hooked up. Are you going to be strong like, you got the upper body to do Oh, that? I'm good. I'm good. I'm just saying. <laughs> no more action, Kenny. Did you win, Kenny? Unless Dustin is just keeping quiet and he's going to show up with a freaking shitload of fish. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Heading in. Weigh-ins, not really weigh-ins. We're just gonna see who uh, who caught the best fish. I don't think anybody caught slam, so it's gonna come down probably to uh, redfish. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight people today. So uh, join the group, man. We're gonna start doing this kind of stuff all the time. A lot of fun. All right, we're back in. It's weigh-in time. What'd you catch? One red. One red. 18 inches. Whoa. Two reds. Two reds. Zip. Zip. Trout. Trout. Inches. All shorts. All shorts. <laughs> same, same, same thing. <laughs> one short. Two flounder. Two. He got two keeper flounder, and I caught one dink trout. I got a bunch. That's all you got. One dink trout. I, I probably had about reds. eight all day. Well, don't blast me in my own video, right? <laughs> 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 
But uh, yeah, we'll get some uh, video of uh, Josh's reds and he takes it, man. Y'all y'all have a good time today? Yeah, buddy. Yeah, definitely gonna do this more. True, true. But yeah, we're gonna start doing this a lot more in the group. So if you're not in the Facebook group, join it. All these guys, they contribute a lot in the group. So appreciate y'all. I'm new to group. And so. girl. And girl. Guys, that was a non, non ginger guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all, let's see these reds. All right, man. How big is that one? 18 inches. 18 and 27, 20. Dang, yeah. You would have placed in like a for real tournament. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. All right, here's Nick's catches. <laughs> nice. Yup, yup. All right, dudes. We're gonna talk about more tournament stuff here in a second. But first, let's talk giveaways, man. This is what y'all really want to hear. Uh, right now, we're 55 subs short of 3,000, and I haven't really revealed what the prize is gonna be for that yet but I pretty much have it uh, put together now what the prize is gonna be. So let me show you some of this stuff, all right? First off is uh, Chip, or Chip Brundage from the Sinker Guy. He's gonna give out one of every size sinkers that he makes. Uh, if you haven't seen these, they're breakaway sinkers. Super high quality stainless steel. And he's also gonna give away uh, some rigs, like Pompano type rigs. Then we got AM Fishing Lures. He's gonna contribute a bunch of different colors of these soft plastics. I'm not 100% the quantity right now, but it's gonna be a lot. Probably between five to 10, maybe more. He's gonna hook it up. Uh, if you haven't heard of these, these lures are crazy, man. They're UV, they glow crazy, crazy bright, and then they're garlic scented. These are super popular in South Texas. Uh, pretty proud of these giveaways because it kind of incorporates a lot of how we got this channel started. Like uh, these are from Jacksonville. These are from South Texas. And then another item in the giveaway is four horsemen corks. You're going to get one of each model cork that they make. There's a bunch of different kind. If you hadn't heard of these, it's a stainless steel wire and it's got ceramic beads on it and Spro swivels. They're super loud popping corks. I think they're the best ones out there. I used a bunch of different ones. So uh, they're from uh, Cut Off, Louisiana. So they're representing. And then uh, another local sponsor from St. Augustine, Fish Bites. Uh, they stepped up. You're gonna get two bags of their Fight Club lures. And then you're gonna get two bags of their Easy Strips. And they also are throwing in a shirt, a hat, and a buff. So crazy good giveaway. Uh, we try really hard on this channel not to flaunt our sponsors because that's not why we do it. And we're not trying to like sell you guys any product or anything like that. But we do have contributors to the channel. So thank you guys so much if you're seeing this. AM Lures, Fish Bites, The Sinker Guy, Four Horsemen Corks. Uh, Check out their pages because they're the ones that are making this possible for you. All right, now the tournament stuff, all right? This was one of many to come. I'm thinking about doing another one this weekend, actually. Um, just join that Facebook group and then I'll just shoot out a message saying that we're gonna do it and then I'm gonna keep most of them low key, just show up, probably a five to $10 buy-in. If everybody agrees, maybe a little bit more. Uh, but no pressure as long as everybody is safe and they're Coast Guard compliant I pretty much have like no additional requests other than all the fish be legal that way We're not violating any FWC regulations uh, And then we are planning on doing a big tournament in the spring and I already have uh, a Bunch of sponsors lined up for that one for pretty legit prizes. We're gonna bring out the grills We're gonna promote it try to get a bunch of people out there like 50 ish. I'm not really sure but yeah, that's gonna be in the spring. So join the Facebook group and I'll keep you guys posted on all the information that's gonna come out about that. So we talked about giveaways, we talked about the tournament stuff. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Uh, subscribe, hit the notification bell, that way you know what's going on. And that's about it, guys. We'll catch you next time. Did not have the opportunity to hold my hand out to all y'all today. Well, there's next time. Yeah. Oh, yeah.